A family. Want to do a quick devotion this morning. Uh, got my Hop Central shirt on, but look under there. Got my Mustangs because they're going to beat uh, Davis County tonight in softball. Just remember that. I said it. I said it. I said it. Hey, quick devotion. You're going to love it. Uh, I want to read the Bible verse first. It's a little bit longer, but I'm sure I promise you it'll resonate with you all. Ephesians uh, 1, 15 and 17 says, For this reason, because I have heard of your, of your faith in the Lord Jesus and your love towards all the saints, I do not cease to give thanks for you. Remember you in my prayers that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, <clears throat> the uh, Father of glory, may give you the spirit of wisdom and revelation and the knowledge of him. There was one part in that that really, really stands out for me, and it says, uh, for this reason, because I've heard of your faith in the Lord Jesus. And with that, I mean, that, I love, love that part. Uh, do uh, people ever talk about you, about your success as an athlete? Uh, have you ever uh, heard or read about yourself in the paper or saw a, somebody post a video of you on social media, how you did well in running, how you did well in soccer, or how you just well, I mean, I know I put a uh, post the other day about how proud I was over Jake and his welding competition. Um, I know for me, it felt good whenever I'd see kids that I've coached or kids that I am coaching or when I get to put stuff about my kids on there and their accomplishment. It feels good. It feels good uh, to see that, to have other people go, hey, I've heard of you. Hey, I've been watching your videos, Molly. Hey, Katie, I saw where you finished uh, really quick and uh, was really fast in that race the other day. You know, for, for me, uh, it's almost like a, uh, a, a big a shot of confidence, it, you know, uh, people noticing the work that you've put in, people noticing the uh, the efforts of the, of the skill that you're honing. Um, it just, you know, it, it actually feels good. And many times it makes you want to work harder and push more harder on, in, in doing that. But what I want to say to you all today is, what about your faith? Are people noticing uh, how your faith has impacted your life or those around you? Are people talking about, uh, have anybody ever brought up uh, how they know, I don't know how you used to be, but I know how you are now. Uh, sorry, waiting for the kids to get out. Uh, does, does people, has anybody ever noticed uh, your walk with him? Uh, being known for sports is fun, but being known because of your faith impacts eternity and God's kingdom. Uh, we love to compete. Uh, in sports, but also I hope that we have a heart to compete for Christ, uh, just like we do with sports. Um, and also, the last thing too is I want to encourage you all: just like working to be better at sports and to work hard to do well at sports, we also have to work hard at staying close to the Lord, at being more like Him, at changing our our hearts, changing our mind. And it's a process, just like jumping higher, just like hitting the softball uh, further, just like running faster, just like giving a shot to a horse or drawing blood. It's something you have to work on to be able to do it well. Uh, hey guys, I hope this was a little bit of encouragement to you all. Uh, I want you to know I, I love you all. Thank the world of you. Quick prayer. Lord, watch over them. Lord, protect them. But most important, Lord, let them realize and, and understand who you truly are in the world and in their lives. Hey, hope you have a great day. See you. Bye.